Hello, my name is Rachel and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be doing standing Pilates for seniors. You don't need anything at all, but I would like you to do this in your bare feet if you can, all right? So go ahead, get yourselves ready and I'll see you in a moment. Okay, so the reason I said bare feet for today is because I really want to work through mobility of the feet and the toes and get you a little bit more aware of where you are on the ground, okay? This is to help with your balance and your mobility. So let's start with our feet hip width apart, making sure that the ankles align with the knees, knees align with the hip bones here, hands on the hips, and we're going to look down to start with. And we're going to try and bring all those toes up off the floor. So keeping the ball of the foot down, the heel down, but lifting the toes. Now you're going to try and spread your toes out as much as you can and then bring them back down onto the floor. And we can do that again. So we're going to lift them up, spread them out, and lay them down. And one more, lift them up, spread them out and lay them down, okay? So try and feel that connection between your feet and the floor. Now we're gonna slightly lean forward so the weight is going into the toes. If you can feel your toes are starting to grip, then you're gonna come back to the center. Then you're gonna slightly lean back so you feel the weight in the heels and back to center. So going forward and back to center and going back and center and last time forward and center and back and center. Okay, so I want you to take the weight over onto the left leg, bending the right leg there. Okay, so you can feel that that heel is lifted and we're just gonna do little circles with the ankles. So just going out and out and out and again really feel the toes on the floor now as that ankle is circling around bring that heel down let's transfer the weight to the other side lift up circling out good so trying to keep the toes on the floor as you do it good and three two one and come on down. So check that your alignment is still the same. Feel those toes pressing down. So we're going to start and work through the legs now. We'll work with some balance. Just do what feels right for you. Okay, so you don't have to do the full exercise as I am. You can modify it if you need to. So hands down by your side. Pull your tummy muscles in. We're going to bend the knees like so. And come up. Bend and come up. So as you bend, think of sticking your bottom out and up and go as far as your knees will allow you. Okay, as long as they're happy, that's all that matters. Good. And three, two, one. Coming up, now we're going to lift up onto the toes and I want you to try and bring your arms all the way up. We're going slowly and then circle back down and lower the heels. So we're lifting up, keep those shoulders down, circling and down. Lifting up, circling and down. Good, lift and lower. Lift and lower. Now you might find you don't get there every time, same with me, but we are working on our balance and down. Let's do a second set of knee bends. So we're going to bend and up. Bend and up. That's it, good. Sitting back, using our legs, our hips here, also working a little bit into our lower back and our glutes. We're going to do three more. Three, two, one. 
Well done. Now we're going to lift up slowly, does it? So up onto the toes, bring those arms up, pull your tummy muscles in, and circle out. Lifting up and circle out. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Good. Lift and lower. One more. Lift and lower. Well done. Okay, so let's take our legs a little wider. And what I'd like you to do now is draw the tummy muscles in, lift up the right foot, and try and rotate out so you're rotating from the hip. Other side, lift, rotate out. And now let's have a little check that when you bend your knees, your knees are able to go over your toes. We don't want them coming in like this. So if that's not working for you, bring your toes in a little until you can get your knees over the toes, okay? So we're gonna pull the tummy muscles in. We're gonna use our arms, so we're going to breathe in. Bring the arms all the way up, keep your back straight, exhale down. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale, good. For four, three, two, one. Now you're going to stay here. We're going to interlace those fingers, reach the arms up, and we're going to try and lift the right heel and down. Lift and down. Lift and down. And lift and down. Stay there, left side. Lift and down. Lift and down. Lift and down. And lift and down. Come on up. We're going to repeat that. So we're going to bend the knees and up. That's it. Good. For four, three, two, one. Stay down. Interlace the fingers. Reach the arms up. Lift the heel. Right heel. Lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower. Other side, lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower, and lift and lower. Come on up, bring those legs in, give them a little shake out. Okay, so we're gonna do a little roll down. Okay, I'm just gonna go sideways for you. You're going to make sure those feet are hip width apart. You're going to pull the tummy muscles in. You're going to take a breath in. Breathe out. Let's take the chin to the chest. Let's pull the abdominals in. Bend those knees and just gently roll forward. Reaching down towards the floor. Okay, and then from here, we're going to reach the arms out. Extending that spine. So trying to lift slightly through the body, can you see? And then come all the way up and circle the arms out to the side. Taking a breath in, breathing out into the chest, rolling down, all the way down. Now reach your arms out, stretch, stretch, stretch. Now start to lift your eye line, lift your chest, coming up, arms out to the side. One more deep breath in, breathing out into the chest, bending the knees, rolling down. Good. Reach the arms out. So sitting back, lifting the eye line, and coming all the way up. Arms out to the side and back. Well done. Okay, so going into a little bit of our balance work now. So if you've done my first video for seniors, this one will be familiar to you. Okay, so we're going to stand here with our right leg bent. We're going to pull the tummy muscles in. We're taking the arms out to the side. Let's turn the palms upwards. Okay, so pull up through that standing leg and then you're going to lift and lower. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Four, three, two, 
one, and you're going to try and hold it there for four, three, two, one, and come down. Let's do the other side. So same thing. So just reset the body, so pull the tummy muscles in, take the arms out to the side, and then we're going to lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower. Good. For four, three, two, one. You're going to hold it here for four, three, two, one and come on down. Let's work the side of the leg, side of the hips now. So taking that right leg out to the side, arms down, turn your palms forward, and again, lift up through the body. We're gonna do a little lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower. So it doesn't have to be big. This is about working on balance. Lift and lower, last two, lift and lower lift, and can you hold it there? Foot off the floor for four, three, two, one, and come down, other side. So reset. Every time you come to the start of the exercise, reset. Think of core, standing up nice and tall, lift and lower, lift and lower, lift and lower. Very good, for four, Three, two, one. You're gonna hold it there for four, three, two, one, and come down. We're gonna take the leg to the back, okay? So I'm just gonna turn sideways. So right leg to the back, tummy muscles in, little tip forward, okay? And then arms out, palms up, shoulders down. And then we're gonna do lift and lower. Lift and lower, lift and lower. Good, four, four, three, two, one. You're gonna hold it there for four, three, two, one, and come down. We're gonna change legs. All right, I know this is challenging, so you just do what you can. Turn these in. All right, slightly forward, arms out, and then we're gonna lift and lower, lift and lower. Good, lift and lower. Four, four, three, two, one. Hold it there for four, three, two, one. Well done, and come on in. Okay, so give those legs a little shake out. All right, so back to feet hip width apart. Okay, now I want you to lift your hands up, take your hands behind your head, and we're gonna tilt over to the side. So I want you to feel the stretch up through the side of the ribs. Then I want you to reach your arms out, bring them back, and come up. Other way, you're gonna go over, reach the arms in opposite directions, Come back and up, over, extend, bend, and up, over, extend, bend, and up. Now, no arms, just going over, inhale, exhale, up, inhale, over, exhale, up. Inhale, over, exhale up, one more. Over, exhale up. Now stand tall, bring your hands around. It's almost like a prayer position. So you've got your hands together and you're gonna pull in. So your thumbs are just touching your sternum, just here, okay? And then I want you to maybe go a little higher. You want to just get to the point where your fingertips are just under your chin and there's contact between your fingertips and your chin. Now we're not going to lose that contact, so keeping your hips where they are, you're gonna take a breath in, and as you breathe out, rotating to your right. All right, but keeping that contact, and then coming back to center. And other way, rotating left. 
and back to center rotating right and center left and center two more and center left and center well done bring those hands down roll your shoulders up back and round up back and around up back and around and up back and around now bring your right arm forward all the way forward lift it up and as it goes back I want you to follow it with your eyes so turn to look behind you come forward up and back forward up and back forward up and back, two more. Up and back. Let's do the same thing on the other side. So bring the hand forward as it goes back. Follow it with your right. So we're doing gentle rotation of your spine. Up and back. Up and back. That's it. Four, three, two, one, well done, coming back. Okay, I'm going to turn sideways. We're going to take our right foot forward and our left foot back. So this is balance, but also ankle and calf strength. We've done this one before in other videos. It's a very good one for working the ankle mobility and challenging your balance. So you're going to bring your hands forward. We call these Aladdin arms in the UK. Uh, after Aladdin, which is a pantomime here. Okay, so we've got our right arm crossed over our left, our right foot forward, our legs are straight. You're gonna take a breath in as you breathe out, push off that left foot and just bring your weight forward onto the right. Now see if you can go back down without falling or tripping or losing your balance, so take it slow. So pushing up, and coming back down, pushing up and coming back down. So you should be feeling tension all the way through the back of that left side, up and down, up and down. You're doing great, two more. And down and up, hold it here, and now I want you to bend both knees, not too far, this is just about balance, and up, inhale, bend, exhale, straighten, bend, and straighten, bend, and straighten, for four, three, two, one, well done, take the hands behind you, bring the feet parallel to each other, reach those hands out and just have a nice stretch through the shoulders, looking up towards the ceiling. Well done, let's do the other side, so taking your right foot back, left foot forward, squaring up those hips, Aladdin arms, but this time left hand, over the right or left arm above the right, shoulders down, pull your tummy muscles in. Now press off that right foot, push yourself up and then slowly lower back down. And as you can see, the coming down is a lot harder because you've got to really control that body. The more you pull your tummy muscles in, the easier it will be. Coming forward and back forward and back good forward and back forward and back let's just do one more forward hold it here tummy's in little bend of the knees and straighten bend and straighten bend and straighten Bend and straighten. Good. Four, 
three, two, one. Coming up, bring your feet to parallel. Take the hands behind you. Interlace those fingers, reaching out and that. Nice stretch there. Okay, now what we're gonna do is pull the tummy muscles in, bend your knees, hinging at the hips. So hinging at those hips, bringing that body forward, bringing the arms as far overhead as feels okay for you. Then you're gonna release the hands. Come on down, take a breath in, breathing out and slowly coming up. Let's try that again. So hands together at the back. Interlace those fingers, stretching out, bending the knees, hinging at the hips, folding the body forward, release the hands, take a breath in, breathing out, coming up. And one more time, interlace those fingers, reaching out, stretch that chest, bend the knees, hinging forward, Good. Arms overhead and down. Take a deep breath in and breathing out, coming all the way up to standing. Okay, and that is your session for today. So thank you so much for joining me. Do press the like button. Do subscribe if you can. Please share this with any friends you think might like to join in with us. And I look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care and bye for now. If you'd like to support me and this channel, then you can buy me a virtual cup of coffee on Ko-fi. See all the details down below in the description box.